What's up guys, it's Tom here and welcome to a brand new Football Talk video and today we discuss Chelsea and Jose Mourinho. Should he get the sack? If you were the Chelsea owner, Roman Abramovich, let me know in the comments below, would you sack Jose Mourinho? And I think uh, I would. And my opinion is that Chelsea are having the worst title defense of any Premier League uh, title that the world has ever seen. I can't believe that they lost today to Bournemouth and I watched the game, I watched the highlights and Bournemouth were actually the better team overall. Chelsea had a good spell in the second half where they dominated and they could have scored but Bournemouth otherwise were brilliant. They didn't go there to park the bus, they went there and they actually attacked Chelsea and that's a big reward for them, the three points and the manager hats off to Eddie Howe, what a story. But listen to these guys. Jose Mourinho, in his first 99 home games with Chelsea, he lost once. In the last seven, he lost four. That's incredible. I mean, they are just two or three points above the relegation zone. It's like the world is turned upside down. Leicester City are first, Chelsea are like 15th. And they were Premier League champions by a country mile last season. Eden Hazard hasn't scored for 16 games. Diego Costa, an absolute shadow of the B striker that we saw last season. Villian is the only shining light for Chelsea. And I think not only they are not scoring goals, they are conceding goals like crazy. And uh, maybe John Terry is past it, he didn't even play today, but their defense has just fallen apart. And, I'm, I, and I think it's, uh, it's mainly Jose Mourinho's fault. Of course, the players have to shoulder a large part of the game of the blame because they they really haven't been good enough this season but Jose Mourinho with his antics I think he really destabilized this team especially with what he did with the Chelsea club doctor former club doctor shall I say Eva Carneiro I heard and read a lot about that and I think that's one of the main reasons why the Chelsea players uh, don't trust Mourinho anymore it looks like they are not playing for him anymore because they were very close to this cop doctor you know anytime they had a problem they go, they went to the cop doctor and Jose Mourinho treated her like absolute shit and the, the way he blamed that club doctor for for one of the defeats was just pathetic and disgraceful and no wonder that that club doctor is now suing Jose Mourinho and Chelsea uh, she left the club earlier this season and I've, that's just one of the reasons but Jose Mourinho really I don't know what he was thinking but he, he just completely destroyed the confidence of this, these players of course the Chelsea results have destroyed their confidence as well and I'm very very interested to find out whether Chelsea will sack Jose Mourinho if they keep him and the results will go on like this because there is no sign of really them improving. Yes, they played a little bit better in the past three games than before, but that's not saying much because they have been playing terrible, defending terribly in the last like 10, 15 games. And, and I just can't see how it can get better. I mean, they need to put together an incredible run of results to even finish in the, in the top uh, six. I'm not sure. And... Uh, Chelsea could be out of the Champions League and some of their players, uh, they might leave, you know, Eden Hazard might leave, but I mean, what happened to Eden Hazard? I, I don't, I can't understand. He was the best player in the Premier League last season and this season, no goals in 16 games. I mean, come on, man. Eden Hazard is, is surely better than that. So I think if Chelsea were to sack Jose Mourinho, the other problem, who do they bring in? They almost, they, they basically almost sacked every potential manager. I have heard Carlo Ancelotti, who would be interested in the Chelsea job. I think he got treated very harshly. Remember, he won the double with Chelsea when he was the manager. Next season, he doesn't win anything and he gets sacked. So basically, Chelsea are like the Real Madrid of the Premier League, sacking managers even when they are successful. And I think Ancelotti could could steady the ship and he could certainly improve the results and um, and he's he's certainly 
was a very very big success at Chelsea so I, I can't understand why Abramovich would, would sack him after winning the double but but he sacked Di Matto who won the Champions League for for Abramovich as well so there is no really no logic I don't think Abramovich will tolerate much longer this, these run of results so Jose Mourinho could get sacked in the next month and I'm so so happy that Jurgen Klopp is at Liverpool and I think that was one of the main reasons why uh, Liverpool went uh, really early and sacked Rodgers, even though I think he should have been sacked at the end of last season, but the club wasn't available then, because I think Liverpool and the owners had, had that in mind, that if Chelsea sack Mourinho, which was a big possibility and still is a big possibility, then they would, they would go for Klopp and Liverpool wanted to, to get Klopp earlier. So I think it turned out brilliantly for Liverpool, but it's an absolute disaster for Chelsea at the moment. Let me know what do you think about this in the comments below. And sorry that there was no career mode video today. I just got home recently, but uh, tomorrow I will be back with a lot of videos. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later. Goodbye.